An industrialist has 450 liters of a chemical which is 70% pure. He mixes it with a chemical of the same type but 90% pure so as to obtain a 75% mixture which is pure. Find the amount of the 90% pure chemical used. So let's have container A with the chemical, this chemical A, with another container B with a certain chemical. The number of liters of the chemical A is 450 and only 70% is pure. The number of liters of this chemical B, we don't know, let's put, let's put it X liters, but it's 90% pure. Now the result is a mixture where we combined the 450 liters plus the X liters and this mixture is 75% pure. So we need to get what is pure. So this is how we are going to tackle this question. The liters of chemical A which are pure plus the liters of chemical B which is pure will give us the 75% uh, pure in the, two in the two chemicals. So 70% of 450 is pure. This will give us 315 liters. Also, we are going to find 90% of X is 0.9X. So 0.9X liters is pure in B. What is pure in A is 350 liters. What is pure in B is 0.9X liter. And therefore, in the final mixture, let's call this mixture C, what is pure will be 75% multiplied by the mixture which is 450 plus x this will give us we'll find the 70 we open this bracket multiply 75 over 100 times 450 that will give us 337.5 liters then plus 0.75 x so in the mixture c this amount of liters are pure so what we're going to do is that A plus B will give us C. That will be 315 plus 0.9x will give us 337.5 plus 0.75x. Collecting the like terms, we're going to take this one to this side and take 315 to the other side of the equation. So we are going to have 0.9x minus 0.75x is equivalent to 337.5 minus 315. The result of this one will be 0.15x is equal to 22.5. Dividing both sides by 0 0.15, we get the value of X as 150 liters. So the amount of chemical B in liters is 150.